my name is Puppeteen from I Love Puppets here today on I Love Puppets Today. Why, you might be wondering. Well, I'm going to tell you it is for Classic Puppet Theater. Yes, another episode here for you. And today we will be covering The Flash and Hawkman. Yes, but first we must introduce that lovely cast you have come to know and absolutely love. And if you say you don't love them, well, I don't believe you because I love them. Starting first is the oh, the main human that we have on this channel from the Bad Batch. It's Zach. He does love me. I'm so happy. What's up, everybody? No, how's it going? Uh, it is me, Zach Garrick, tonight uh, in honor of our source material. So ready to have some fun, some fast and furious fun. And if <gasps> there is a Zach Garrick... That's what we should call this, the Fast and the Furious, because Flash is fast and Hawkman gets angry. No, I think we'll be okay. <sighs> okay. <fine. laughs> you, you, you did. It might be the name of this episode. How about that? <laughs> yes. But speaking of Zach Garrick, it's time to talk about Frog Hawk himself. Froggy in the darkness. Say hello, Froggy. Dan, 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 Dan. That's what's going on, my peeps. I thought yeah, you were I playing mean, Hawkman. Yeah. My Why peeps. were you playing Eye of the Tiger? Because he's playing, uh, he's going to say, uh, he's going to do the voice in uh, Rocky Balboa. Oh. Yo, I, thought hey, he, I thought he got a Hawkman confused with Bronze Tiger for a moment. <laughs> you know. <laughs> <laughs> That's a low blow. <laughs> <laughs> little inside joke you should check out our reading of suicide squad you'll get it uh, <laughs> but yes froggy of course and uh he is absolutely Yo, Zach, i did it <laughs> <laughs> i actually want him to read it hawkman like that now oh no uh but you know it, we have th this man this frog that uh identifies as a man and i am a puppet a male puppet, but we need. Well, are you a male puppet? I had another nose. We'll check. Yeah. You're down. Oh I'm God! Get your hand. Get your hand down. Is he a uh, man or is he a puppet? <laughs> I don't see anything need, up there. We need that feminine touch, and who has it but Moranya? And hello, Moranya. Hello. She's got the touch. She's got the power. You can't see she me. She has I'm, I'm the power. I can't see what? You can't see me, but I'm touching you. That's gross. You know. <laughs> what? I you better you. wash or you'll get warts. No, that's you, bro. Did you use a cream yet? <laughs> no, no, no. no. The bridge. That, that, the, that was, that's a different <laughs> cream. We're going to have that conversation another time. Under the bridge. Anyway. No, we're never going to have under that conversation. Under the bridge. Do, 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 do. Under the bridge. Under the bridge. Under the bridge. I think that's enough for Disney to get you. That that is enough. So you, you need to calm down. Uh, yeah, but <laughs> Disney let's be honest, this <laughs> might be enough for DC to get us as well. Oh, 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 oh crap! You found me. <laughs> <laughs> you can run from me, Froggy. I'll grab my gun. Oh no. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> let's go ahead and get straight down to business. I'm going to show let's this, get and dangerous. I'm going to. I, I, this is a puppet service announcement right here. The reason why we are using this site is because these comics are not available anywhere digitally. Nowhere. It's very sad. It's very. It's a tragedy. DC, okay. if you're listening, correct yourselves. Mm -hmm. So we can't read the Flash and Hawkman yeah, yeah. as they should be in a brilliant new light. Uh, but you know what we can do? We can read it off of this site, which Froggy has found. And you can read it yourself if you wish. But uh, this is the only reason we're doing it. Otherwise, we would pay like good customers we are. Well, not Froggy. He, he's a pirate. But that's besides the point. Let's go ahead and just show off this right <sighs> here. Uh, Flash Comics uh, featuring in this issue the Hawkman. This time Hawkman is taking the uh, starring position of the cover. Uh, featuring he's the taking the yeah he's taking the flight to the crime. Oh my what gosh! Look at the top of that building that just gets. Wow, that's some like Transformers level. 
That's property destruction. Who's shooting rays? Is it the ray shooting rays? No. No. Uh, and we're going to just skip over oh, these ads. Is it a handgun on top one? <laughs> it was probably like a BB gun. Or Look at that. Red Rider, Red Rider BB oh, gun. Hands up. One. Pistol cigarette case. You get a midget <laughs> pocket radio for 69 cents? I want a handgun yeah. cigarette case. That's what I want. <laughs> anyway, we're going to read The Flash. I will be taking the role of the narrator in this uh, brilliant issue. We're going to have, of course, Zach as Zach Garrett. Uh, which is Jay Garrick, uh, and that is The Flash. Uh, Marania is taking the lady's role, so she will be talking to herself a little bit, but yeah, it should be fine. And I'll be taking the role of the hard water. No, no, no. <laughs> no. You're, you're going to be taking the role of everybody else. Uh, so. Yeah, I get the, all of the voices out of my head. The Flash into a world of humdrum reality a human comet has rocketed a living breathing bolt of chain lightning the flash the fastest thing on earth the flash can eat run walk talk and act faster than thought and poop. His, mm -hmm. <laughs> his top speed is so great that he cannot be seen by human eyes true. man can you imagine if he crapped us he could hit a whole city <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Oh no. While a student at Midwestern University, Jay Garrick was overcome by fumes of hard water gases, and the doctors told him Hard water speeds up human reactions. You inhale the essential element it contains for that speed. You could travel faster than a bullet, young man. Why is Colonel Sanders my doctor? <laughs> <laughs> Jay, uh, no, I don't want to hear what he thinks about Jay Garrick. Uh, instead, Jay Garrick has decided to fight crime with his great speed as the Flash. Ah, uh, you know, oh, sorry. I keep I keep getting that Flash mixed up. I'm sorry. The funny thing is that if he went for profit for himself, he could just you know be the Pony Express faster than that. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I mean, yes. Uh, one winter night on the stage of the Fancy Follies of 1940, one of the girls screams and falls. Ah! Ooh, she's hurt. She's been shot. The terrorized girls run for the exit door. It's like Black Friday at Walmart. Oh, no, 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 no. Wow, Zach. <laughs> As Joan Williams passes the theater. Oh, pardon. Theo, Parker, whatever is the matter with you? Joan Williams, friend of the Flash, recognizes a college chum. A shooting. Tell me all about it. And then Vi screamed and fell. Somebody shot her with a maximum silencer gun. Maybe I can get somebody to help us. The Flash. And as the taxi whizzes around the corner. Huh, that looked like Joan. Here's here's where I have some fun with Joan. I'll <laughs> race her. <laughs> Jay, no. I'll <laughs> race her home. <laughs> hey, ladies, what's going on? You wanna get that? <laughs> For one instant inside the car. Hey, a man. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> I know, that's not creepy at all. <laughs> I tell you, I saw a man's face. Hey, ladies, how's it going? I'm Flash. It must have been Flash. The Flash reaches Joan's room before she does and playfully hides. <laughs> the so it's a different time. Yes, it's a very different time. Peeky boo, I see you. Oh, crap! The strange thing about this is that two other girls have been shot in the theater recently. And all of them knew one man, a Lord Donald of Ireland. At least that's what he said he was. Froggy's going to have to do an Irish accent. I am both intrigued and horrified. <laughs> Top of the morning to you, laddie. Okay, oh, now I'm not as horrified. I'm more intrigued. Top uh, of the morning to you, laddie. That's terrifying. What was that? My nose. I got a faint. Give me my smelling salts. <laughs> I suspect funny business here. An instant later at the Flash's home. 
I'm glad I can dress and undress in a hurry. Here goes nothing. But surprisingly, he's still late for dinner with his wife. The Flash ransacks the Fancy Folly's dressing rooms. Oh, no. Oh. In the meantime... This Lord Donnellan took out Hilda, Tess, and Vi, and then something happened to each one of them. I'm going out to visit Lord Donnellan. No sooner has Joan left than... Eek! The man at the taxi window! Where did Joan go? She's gone to see Lord Donnellan to find out his connection with the shootings. Wait, she's in Joan's bed. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. It's like, oh, no. uh, what if Jay was coming looking for Joan? <laughs> oh, <you got> her. <laughs> I remember he said again, dress and undress. Uh-huh. Yeah. yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. The telephone book falls from the rack, and the Flash is studying it. That old antique. Donnellan. Donnellan. Ah! The sudden appearance and disappearance of the Flash is too much for Theo. Nuts! I'm going nuts! Wait, wait, so Theodore? Huh? Yeah, she's, she's Theodora. Theodora, Theodore. but they're just starting as a Theo. Okay, I was confused. I'm like, I guess unless, I won't unless, judge. Unless it's the first transgender character, who knows? We would never know. The Flash leaves a path of excite, uh, excitement as he as he puts through uh, mm -hmm. the crowded streets. Yeah. Yeah. Quit shoving. Somebody better quit blowing on my neck. <laughs> my hurt. Jay is being really creepy in this <laughs> in this issue. Uh, old uh, Dick I, in that crowd. I'm Jay Garrett. <laughs> <laughs> in Lord Donlin's apartment. But these girls, he said, uh, okay, I guess, Papatini, you want to read one of them? I'll, uh, I think Donlin's on the right side, I think, right? Yeah. But these girls, it's tough on them, Gaul. Oi, none of that, you see, you. They're about to terrorizing them. My the antenna. Ah, the antenna. I'm Greg McConnor. <laughs> <laughs> or Connor McGregory, I don't know what you would call me. The entertainment industry. Ah, fuck it. <laughs> Can't you see that by terrorizing the entertainment industry? He's not Scottish. I'm sorry. It's the closest he could do. I'm giving Go it all I got. <laughs> I, buy, I, I buy them out very cheaply, and this will be the start of our work on the radio and move industry, too. I own the whole world's entertainment industry. Study this. There will be some news that will interest you. Eventually, he'll take over. Latest news. Greta Garson has been shot at Mike of LBC radio station in serious condition. Assailant unknown. A lightning bolt. I throw a lightning bolt now? Off his chest? I don't know. Oh, I guess not. My metal calling card. I'm the Flash. Behind the Flash, a door opens noiselessly. But the Flash's keen ears hear oh. gold breathing. Oh, okay. So you're supposed to be the oh, guy in the. the guy. Uh, okay, that's why. Okay. All right, then. Yeah, you can be the bold guy because you are bold. I'll be okay. Donald. All right. No, you don't. Donovan, do something. Go ahead. Pull the trigger, punk. <laughs> okay, wise guy. You asked for it. But right. as Donovan pulls the trigger, the flash leads away, leaps away uh, like a streak of lightning. Hey, I'm over here. Bing. Ting. Bzz. Bzz. Oh. That'd be Joan. Adieu, gentlemen. I'll see you later. I'm going to take you home. You certainly are not. Oh, no. <laughs> Typical oh, no. woman. I'll tell you what to do. <laughs> well, here we are. Say, what is this? A public highway? <laughs> <laughs> That's what you call yourself. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. bridge. <laughs> Those cooks headed by Gaul are out to terrorize the entertainment industry. Theo told me all about it. Go on. I'm curious. <laughs> Donalyn got drunk one night and let enough slip so that Theo put two and two together. They'll buy up the theaters at a cheap price and start on radio and the movies. 
back at Donalyn's apartment. These are the orders for our operatives when... The door just opened. Where is the packet? <laughs> you worry too much. I got the packet right here. That's gross. <laughs> but in a flash, the Flash grabs the packet and is on his way. I think you mean you had it. You mean... That, that is stealing. I don't care if you're a hero. That's stealing. <laughs> yeah, I mean... It's not addressed to you. Yeah, it's true. It's a federal offense. Orders to shoot more radio and theatrical stars. I've got to stop them. The lobby of the two o'clock nightclub. Is he a part of the performance? Uncouth. Utterly uncouth. The penguins there. The As order. Stella Rollins sings on the dance floor. Roll out the barrel. We'll have a barrel of fun. A sinister stranger in the audience takes careful aim. That is a weird song for like in a classy joint like that. It is, actually, yes. Bang! Now your life is safe with the compliments of the flash. And he left gas. <laughs> oh, he's gone. Now for the Elson Theater. The gunman is due to show himself. Aha! Ooh. Holy crap. You know what it is, right? It's uh, Ronald Reagan. Uh, <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> the Flash's alert eyes, see? Time to get going. The Flash's speed raises hats and clothes as he tears along the aisle. Oh, my. Whoop. Whoopee! Marilyn Monroe. <laughs> I, I wouldn't if I were you. Who are you? The flat, the, the flash moves too swift for the eye to see, and this'll hold you. <laughs> you can't go very far now. <laughs> <laughs> He's wearing a, a skirt. He had to touch that guy something in order to take the clothes off. <laughs> I'm just saying, you don't. My last stop, the Rogers Estate, near Satan. Also, that bridge looks unsafe. Yeah, a little bit. Through, yes. Through lone, uh, wait, lonely... Wait, is that lonely or lovely? Yeah. Lonely. lonely. Lonely country roads tears the flash. While at Rogers Estate... Uh, my dear, we can't wait to hear you sing. I'm so nervous. I feel something terrible is going to happen. Uh, my guest star of the evening, Della Roberts. <laughs> He's creeping in the window. <laughs> mm. I don't think any of these guests can be a racketeer yet. With a whirring noise, a panel in the wall swings open, and the crossbow bars hum across the room. A hidden <laughs> mechanism, I might have known. The ba uh, barb is barb, stored. Barb. Stopped. An inch barb, from barb. Okay, barb. Listen, it's very hard to see. Yeah, uh, no, it's it is bad. I, well, after a minute, it actually comes to focus. Either that, I'm going crazy. The barb is stopped an inch from Della Roberts' throat. <laughs> Aha. Car carpenter, who has been working in a street, must have done this. Yeah, I always blame the carpenters. They're always the bad guys, right? We've learned it from history. You took it very calmly. <laughs> I, can't, I, can't, I, I can't break down here, but on my way back to town, boy, will you hear a woman scream? I've heard you. Tell me, do you use a horse? Get that you are so about, get about so fast. No, can't be bothered dragging a horse around with me. <laughs> so long, I have an appointment in town. Yeah, he's dragging a dead horse. Wow. He's dragging a the trap is baited. When the flash enters, the guns will all go off at once and poof. Cool, and the car's ready. Just before the flash arrives, Gaul's car pulls from the curb. The flash walks into the trap. Bang! 
You can but Flash's up. speed yeah. is even greater than that of the bullets, and he escapes unharmed. Ha ha! Gone! And let the trap for me. I'll show him. I'll show him all. <laughs> Alrighty. Out into the night races the Flash. I'll get him if it kills me. Oh Next my gosh. In square. And Look at the car like accident. It looks like he caused a couple of car accidents. <laughs> at least, yes. Again! <laughs> oh, a peeping Tom. Hey, my dear, where? He's got a lipstick on his face. You notice that? The detail? Oh, yeah. yeah I see that. They, were, they were kissing in there. Uh, the flash appears from thin air in a trolley. As the kids say, they're, they're getting fresh. <laughs> and <laughs> races the train along its platform. Not in here either. You should check the women's bathroom. <laughs> when, while the Flash continues his search. Lower Donnan has a mountain cabin at Boone Lake. If he tries to get away, that's where he'll go. I have a hunch the Flash will scare him into going, hurry, Theo. Have a Duro? It's an important cigarette. Very rare over here. I'll try one. <laughs> The human bullet continues his search. Oh, sorry. I'm looking for a pal. Go. No luck yet. We can't read. Yeah, go. yeah. No luck yet. Help, help, a maniac. <laughs> Whoa, a Juro. That means Joan. <laughs> I wonder if she's working on information I don't oh, possess. Because only Joan smokes in that town. No one else... <laughs> Only Joan smokes Duro's. That's right, because Duro is the brand for you. If you're a woman. <laughs> no charge for pedestrian traffic, is there? If, you per if you're a pedestrian, I'm a paralyzed snail. <laughs> Joan's car. Come on, girl, step on it. You're holding me up. Must be a marathon runner, but I've trailed him five miles and he isn't tired. Maybe, maybe that last drink was too much for us. Drinking while driving is not safe. Mm -mm. Unless what? you're a guy. <laughs> In the open countryside, Jones steps on the gas. Ah, that's better. The girls arrive at Lord Donnellan's hideaway with the flash right behind. The girls take Gull and Lord Donnellan by surprise. Put him up! Not so fast, my pretty one. I'm not very pretty, if you met me. You're beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Why, thank you. <laughs> I'll dump them in the back of the car. I was never so glad to see you. That goes for me double. Well, that's that. We'll turn these fellows over to the police, and then I'll race you girls home. Don't miss the next exciting adventure of The Flash in next month's Flash Comics. Dun, dun, dun. Now, wasn't that a lot of fun? Hey, he didn't kill these guys. This yeah. <laughs> no, 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 he didn't kill anybody last time. He let them die. He let them, okay. Yeah, well, he like, didn't, yeah, yeah. You know this caused how many accidents on the that's, road? That's true. He did cause a bunch was of cars. Was that an expressway too? No, was yeah. 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 He's he's still learning. He's in his man of steel phase where he's still learning how to be a superhero. I can't wait till we get to the issues if we ever do where he starts to vibrate. Now, no, no, you don't. No, no, no. The, the Flash was, yeah. Jake Garrick was the one that first one to discover how to vibrate. And oh yeah, face walls. no, I know, I know. Yeah, but get, get you your see. mind out of the gutter or brick wall. Oh well, in this next uh, adventure, because we're not done yet, we have the Hawkman, and I already have it uh, up and about, and I'm going to pull up the screen in a minute, playing the role of Hawkman. We have Froggy down at the bottom. Mm -hmm. And and the role of uh oh, what's her name? Shira. Shira. 
Shira. Shira. Yeah, that's right. Uh, is the lovely Marania. And of course, as the uh, background man, the main villain, uh, we have Zach. And I will serve as your narrator for this issue as well. Now, let's get reading. Yay! 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 Goodbye! The Don't Hawk eat. Man. Foe to crime is the Hawk Man. Reincarnation of an ancient Egyptian warrior, fighter against the strange forces that powerful cr criminals use. He fights the evil of the present with his collection of what of the weapons of the past. An unseen force strikes the heart of the city. It's the end of the world. Earthquake! Look out for the bricks. High above the catastrophe. Uh, could, could, geez, catastrophe flies the Hawkman. I can't understand it. It's like a bolt from the blue and the wolf. That's Shira down there. Shira! Shira, beloved comrade of Carter Hall, wealthy collector of weapons and research scientist. Let me free. You're hurting me. Oh, the Hawkman. Like a plummet, the hawk drops to the rescue. Gar, gar. <laughs> How terrifying. <laughs> Darling, are you all right? Yes, yes, but get me away. All right, where should oh. I drop you? <laughs> the weapon hall of Carter Hall. The weapon room, sorry. Now, now, Shira. You'll be all right in a second. That terrible crash the, as the buildings fell apart. The screams. It was horrible. I'm getting dressed, and I'll go have a drink, back, and I'll be back in a jiffy. Carter Hall, the Hawkman, emerges. Well, that caused the earthquake in the one. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Secret Emmy. <laughs> well, what caused the earthquake? I, I wonder. A man named Alexander. Luther. <laughs> no. Alexander, how did I, how did you know? You said you wouldn't mix in trouble again if we got married. We're engaged, darling, but not yet married. Or married yet. I'm still Wait. a bachelor. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want me to stop, and not if the hawk can avenge the horror of, the, of tonight. What do you know about it? It's no use. I may as well tell you. Five hours later. <laughs> <laughs> Three days later. Shira tells her story. A great physicist calling himself Alexander the Great is out to conquer the entire globe. He has invented a machine that increases an object's weight 1,000 times. He plans to destroy all seaboard cities unless the government buys them. <laughs> Why buy him off when I might be able to do something? He intends to start in America. He wants Alexander's old empire and a modern one, too. He's beginning his campaign of terror tonight. How do you know all this, Yara? Because this Alexander has invited us both to dinner tonight. Do you escape invitations for dinner from strange men? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> It's gospel truth. We're to call it 10 for dinner. It's strictly formal. And pretty late, too. In Hawk's powerful special Lincoln, which you can buy in uh, any <laughs> Lincoln realtor. Uh, Turner Hall and Shire Hall sold separately. Get a hold of Matthew McConaughey. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Anyway. I don't like this. We're stepping into a trap. Okay, I was a red turd. <laughs> Alexander has too much confidence in himself for that, but just in case, I brought the hawk's robes with me and a Grecian sword of Alexander's times. Your metal owings are in the back. Would I ever do without you? You'd get yourself into a jam and not be able to get out of it. Aww. Typical woman smartass. <laughs> Shut up. It's a sweet moment. 
The home of yeah. Hank Pym was right. <laughs> wow. The of the modern Alexander the Great. Quite a place. Quite a place. Oh, you've arrived on time. Why, yes. Is there some sort of show going on? Some might call it that. I'm hoping you will not. You're the only one I need fear, Hawkman. You fear me? Of course, darling. Haven't I told him all about you? It's courteous to warn our enemies. <laughs> I... I told you, I still can't correct it. Not. <laughs> yeah. I know the hawk possesses much ancient wisdom lost to the modern generations. The hawk knows much and is wise. He does not enter the fight unless he can win. Unfortunately, I will win between us two. Yet, I would be sure. Shall we dine? Yeah, sure. You should eat the food first. It's poison. <laughs> <laughs> the dinner masks the subtle battle between the hawk and Alexander. No. Oh, okay. I guess. I guess. <laughs> well, no. His top bubble is higher than mine. That's why. Yeah, but it's it is your yours goes first. All right, fine, fine, whatever. You spoke of being sure of victory. Yes. Would you consider a million dollars to remain friendly? But first, I would show you. Hey, keep your pants. My laboratory oh, okay. of it. <laughs> and a few experiments. Please enter. Inside the labor laboratory of the world's greatest physicist. Allow me to demonstrate for you my weight gun. Please do. Don't turn it on me. I weigh enough. Oof. Ow. Oh. Self burn. I am now ready to approve <laughs> or deny that. <laughs> Observe these light ping pong balls. I drop them in the water. The balls float. Now please watch as I switch on my machine and take note of my giant cranium from the you, side. You know, I think if this was actually was a, a comic comedy, he'd be like, oh, there's a weight gun to shoot the guy. <laughs> 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 They're sinking. Oh, I've dropped my balls. If only Puppet Team could do that. They are quite heavy. It requires some <laughs> exertion to lift them. Shara, give him a hand. Two. <laughs> <laughs> Would you demonstrate this on, a, on this warehouse? Gladly. Horse. Horse. Sorry, horse. Yeah. Yeah. Gladly. One moment while I set the machine. Once again, the machine hums and purrs. It's green, green. message. Yes. Mm -hmm. Now, try to lift it. I, I can't. I told you so. Now, do you take the million and leave me in peace? If we do not, do we leave here safely tonight? I must have my sleep, Alex. <laughs> well, you're free to go, as, as always, and as free to call. As long as you do not interfere. Is this why Hawkman smokes all the time? <laughs> I, I suppose so. right. Well, I'm too frank. To show, to, I don't know how, to, how long that'll be. Well, Carter. I'm curious. Let's go. So as uh, not to arouse suspicion. Less than a mile down the road, the car jerks to a stop. What now, little man? My nymph metal, that's in my wings. That's in my wings here. It's gravity resisting. If it can stand a dose of the green of the green light, I'll declare war on Alexander. Go to it, darling. This metal is lighter than air. It's hard to hold down. I'll try a, I'll just try a bit of it. Safe so far. I hope I can reach the machine without being discovered. He made it. 
Now for the test. Ah, now to lift the stuff and see. The ninth metal resists the power of the machine. Good, I guess it's a uh, it's war, Alexander. We'll see if you deserve the title of the great. Well, what news? Well, I imagine the score a hot babe in there while it's in there. <laughs> and some cigarettes. They're the best. <laughs> my mid metal suffers no effects. The machine multiplies the atomic energy, and my metal has no such energy in its makeup, and I won't need that blaming sword. Later in Hall's library. If my Grecian sword is no good, why this net and trident? Because I'm trying to capture Uncle Man. <laughs> <laughs> the net is made from uh, nymph metal. It works uh, thusly. You used your sword. Wait, she has a sword? She has a sword. Yikes. Boss woman right there. <laughs> uh, the mimic duel. Well, she's not a hot woman yet. I think that's like in our 20 years. <laughs> boss, boss, it, it was a compliment because she is certainly very, very feisty, I would say. Anyway, 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 anyhow, you just had to mess it up. <laughs> the mimic duel. You see, the net will stop with the weight gun. My trident is made of the nymph metal also. And I, and I have on a flexible mesh work of the stuff. I go tonight to fling the gauge, a sort of ultimatum. But be careful. Off Don't talk about the new woman. <laughs> to the <laughs> attack. <laughs> Alexander plans another barrage. Mm, the government would not reply to my ad in the paper. Another dose of this becomes necessary. But as the machine begins to hum... In another moment, it will warm up, and then a Jew, New York, in your overpriced Broadway shows. <laughs> the Hawkman drops like a bullet from the sky. Just in time. You... Here! Again! Exactly, Bozo. I fancy you might be surprised, so I came prepared. Have a net. Will you forgo your insane plans, or is it war between us? I... I never... I'll beat you yet, you... The hawk does not notice a furtive hand. The <laughs> turn for... Silly of me. Alexander drags the wounded Hawkman to his underground laboratory. I'll destroy him with my other machine. When the machine makes him so heavy he can't lift his own body, he'll starve. Now, back upstairs to see the results I'm getting up there. Full if on, the Hawkman's body plays the green light. Um... <laughs> Kira <laughs> grows nervous while waiting. He said he'd start back in 30 minutes. It's nearly an hour. I'm going in. Is she taking your trench coat off? Oh. The, the hawk. What's happened to him? The white gun is still going strong. I hear that machine humming. She discovers the hawk in the underground laboratory. Oh, hawk. Are you hurt? Hawk. Don't move. Don't let the ray get in your eyes. Right, you are. I turned it off. Now what? Now for Alexander, and how I mean. Keep below. This is my party. You! You selfish thing! All is in readiness. <laughs> oh, yeah? <gasps> you! Me and you, chum. Using his net carefully, the hawk draws in. No, you don't. This time, it's for keeps. Roman tried it against Greek brains and modern weapons. Ah! Trident gum saves a day. You're safe. 
of course, get busy. Chihuahua. I almost, I almost read, I almost read that. Of course, baby. <laughs> 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 this machine must be destroyed so no other crackpot can ever use it again. And the one downstairs. Never complained before. <laughs> This goes into my collection. You would. You never keep a good. You can never keep a good woman down unless you got a machine. <laughs> oh, how about finishing our cocktails now, baby? No, Carter, come and eat your breakfast. It's ready. Follow the Hawkman <laughs> into new and exciting adventures in next month's Flash Comics. Oh goodness, that last panel. That's what she said. In the nineteen forties. Oh the last panel's fine. The last panel. Hey, it's so great. You're right. It's so great. Here's looking at you, kid. <laughs> anyway, those are great. The, I do really love the, the those stories. And you know what? I'm enjoying them more and more. And hopefully we'll be back with some more soon. I want to thank everybody for showing up. Uh, anybody have something they'd like to say about the comic? I'd like to say that I've been enjoying these Hawkman uh, comic books. Froggy? Uh, yeah? Clear your throat. What's wrong with my throat? <laughs> then go ahead. Just. <clears throat> I think you've got a hawk in your throat. Do I have a hawk in my throat? Or maybe you're just uh, hearing my new voice. When those balls dropped. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they were too heavy to pick back up. Uh, I, I love said, these. I, the writers of these books clearly had no sense of how here. some phrases and how um. Because back then evolved. they weren't they weren't perverts back then. <laughs> well, no, no, they, they say just, that they just kept it hidden. <laughs> they kept, they tried to keep it hidden. They let hidden. little bits come through. Here, help me pick up my balls. I seem to have dropped them. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> anyway. There, oh, there, that's better. there he is. The, these books are a lot of fun, and I think we're going to enjoy the uh, next ones that we're going to go through. I want to uh, know. I, 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 we got to see if there's any John Wayne comics. Uh, can you write a All righty, Pilgrim. Okay there, Pilgrim. Let's oh, go, Pilgrim. Well, uh -huh. uh, I'm not going to hit you. I'm not gonna hit you. Like heck, I'm not. My name's Rooster Cogburn. They call me uh, the Rooster. Well, we'll we'll see. Uh, you know what? Speaking of other comics, if you have a comic that you're interested in, one that you would like to see uh, some of us or all of us read, then how about you go ahead and check out our Ko-Fi. Uh, at our Ko-Fi, if you want to leave a tip, it would be greatly appreciated. Uh, it, and if you have a specific issue of some sort of comic you would like to see us perform, then we will. Uh, we, we absolutely will. Uh, then just go ahead to the Ko-Fi. Uh, it should be down in the description below. Uh, yes, you can see uh, Froggy's hopping uh, hopping about it. Moving right along. Yeehaw! <laughs> we'll read them all. We'll but read Hawkman. We'll read Wonder Woman. We'll read Superman and many others. We'll read your yes. Miranda rights. Zach we'll is just going to be in the commercial now. <laughs> yeah, we'll read you your Miranda rights. <laughs> you the right to remain silent. <laughs> but <laughs> no, we don't want them to remain silent. We want their comments and their likes and all that good stuff that the YouTube algorithm also. And likes. if you want to give us some money, because remember, comic books cost money. Sadly, the Ko-Fi link that's usually going across the ticker part, but some idiot keeps forgetting to put it on there. Well, I'll make the ticker next time, but be sure to check it out in the description below. It's right there, and you can absolutely click on it at any time. And below that is my Twitter account. You can go ahead and follow there and get updates for whenever we're going to be doing stuff on the channel, because I know YouTube can lag yep. sometimes. Yep. Just yeah. ask Maranya. I mean, yes, please, just for... for just for a dollar a day, you can save this starving puppeting. You <laughs> I, I just want to say it, it doesn't even have to be a... <laughs> I, I did want to say though, in that first uh, comic, the first story, we got we, we got we got a premonition of Disney. Because he was yeah. he wanted to, and he wanted to own all of entertainment. That's Disney. Yeah. Oh please, yeah. Please for a dollar a day, you can keep the puppeting from under the bridge. 
Yes, yes, yes. I will no longer be. I have to go under the bridge. If you drop a uh, drop a dime in that uh, coal fire, you can't drop a dime. You can only drop a dollar. Is the lowest thing. Shh, shh, shh. They don't know that. Once they're there, yeah, well, they, they go drop a dime. Oh. They're not gonna drop a dime. They're not gonna drop a dollar. Yet. Don't well, be. Uh, I don't be a coroner's unless you don't know how to be one. <sighs> Okay, even a dollar. Drop a dollar if you could. And go ahead, tell us something you'd like us to read. Uh, we're going to continue with these stories and continue with Spider-Man and uh, maybe with Star Wars. We'll see how that goes. Uh -huh. Yeah, uh, that'll be, that's going to be a treat. <laughs> Y'all are in for a delight, maybe. <laughs> so be on the lookout for those and be on, uh, make sure that you are subscribed because we are going to get as much content as we can out for you. We want you to enjoy yourselves. We enjoy ourselves, but you should be a part of that too. So we, until next time, thank you so much. Uh, thank you to all the performers and we will see you soon. But until then, bye. bye!